this procedure, the bone marrow aspiration or bone marrow draw is about a 45 minute procedure. And then it takes a couple hours for us to process that and extract all the healing cells. Meanwhile, the patient went off and went shopping and just had some free time. But then the actual bone augmentation procedure is about an hour, maybe an hour and a half. With the joint replacement, you're staying in the hospital anywhere from one to three days and the procedure itself because you go under full anesthesia it could take three or four hours. Patients generally will, will use some pain medicines after the procedure but, but not a lot. So generally, I'll give them a prescription for maybe a two-day maybe a three-day supply of an opioid pain medicine like Vicodin or Lortab but generally patients use pain medicines that night and the next day and after that maybe maybe Tylenol for a day or two but otherwise they really don't need pain medicines afterwards which is nice because pain medicines can be constipating some people get sick to their stomach and you can't drive a car if you're on pain medicines like you would be for after a surgery you might be taking them for a week or two so patients can get out and do their normal activities and go shopping and do things as soon as they're off of any pain medicines and that's, like I said, it's generally one or two days.